Hello everyone, this is Jubar Mahmood, a data driven digital marketing expert. In this video, you will know about how to track outbrand pixel and outbrand purchase tracking. So, uh, reason being creating this video is uh, outbrand is a new platform. Hopefully, this video will be helpful for you and who want to know about something new so at first we have we have to know about what is outbrain outbrain basically outbrain is a advertising platform as like google it like here are the advertiser are we created the ad and uh, the outbrain the medium has uh, placed the ad to the website on google adsense that's why it works so this is the website at first you have to create uh, the account in outbrain which is very simple process you just go here and uh, sign up as the requirement process so after this you will be seeing like dashboard like this i have done some practice and this is my tag manager we will be set up pixel with outbrain outbrain pixel with google tag manager because this tag manager is connected my this dummy website my google tag manager is successfully connected with this website and i have enabled the data layer and now right now it is new completely new so here is the outbrain uh, you have see lots of option here this is the overview if you create a campaign you can see here you can go to the outband uh, amplify this is the funnel this is the conversion this is the audience this is the report this one the real time data the data is coming from when you run ads it will be see here it is the real time data there is this is the account setting so past conversion that i have made but right now we will be create a, a new pixel to make sure it is easy for you so at first here is to see the outbrain pixel you will be create here click here and you will be see this option and here you see copy and paste in your website here you see you just copy it and you can uh, take a notepad and paste it here okay okay then we have go our tag manager and tag manager we have go a tag tag configuration here you can find the tag template you can just place the base tag in here like uh, cop copy it and paste it here you can just paste it here but it it is page view even but you can also do that but we'll be do a another smart way so at first we will be go discover more tag template in community gallery when we click there and we will search here out brain okay this is the official we will be add it to workspace okay add it will be edit edit in your workspace okay and as you see here here we see marketer id as we like this is the version adv id this one is the id you just copy it from here and copy you just paste it here okay paste it here this is the page view pixel make sure you click there uh, not to do anything then we will be trigger it all the pages and name it out brain page view okay we just paste it here and save also also we will be submitted and you just uh, do another thing this is when and when you will be and here you can see the chrome plugin chrome plugin this plugin outbrain pixel tracker this pixel this pixel is the outbrain pixel uh, pixel tracking you just click here and you can find the chrome plugin okay it will be it will be see you how the tag is will be set up or not okay we have set up the uh, outbrain chrome extension and also we have submitted this then we will be then we will be preview the preview the tag manager see the our tag is well uh, submitted or not working or not okay 
we just go our tag our website tag assistant is connected as we see oh, we have loaded our website and here we can see the page view event was fired here is the marketer id this one is this one is same fa this one is same okay our page view event was fired okay. now we will be set up purchase event okay for purchase event here we see the ad conversion outbound pixel here the ad conversion at first you have to set up the pixel base pixel so we have done it and then we will be create here the event base tracking and here here you see the category category of purchase purchase i have already created on this why this one is purchase one okay this is the click and conversion value if your website has static value you can paste it here and if you have dynamic value uh, you have uh, put something and it will be tracked by the uh, data layer variable in google tag manager so okay save we have paste the save and here we see some code was there so we have the template in our google tag manager so we can do that we can do that by here our brand pixel and also we have set up the page view so that's why it is event based event based and here is the purchase purchase and here are some custom parameter you have to put currency you need to give transaction this is this transaction id and this is the order value it is it is needed so we need to do a purchase to build up a data layer variable so at first we do the purchase we have done the purchase we have we have purchased so that's why we will be triggered it the custom event this one is custom event custom event of purchase and we will be say purchase 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 trigger this one is purchase trigger this trigger will be happen when a purchase has happened in our website we build a data layer variable this one is value so as you see take the transaction id here this this will be help to know about our brand this is a unique transaction has happened this is the transaction id and this is the value order value and it will be help to uh, know about our brand which uh, type of value has happened so value we have named this one our brand our brand purchase outbrand purchase tag or save like we have set up all the thing and we will be submit it if we do another purchase we will be know the scenario about is is the everything is well right and here we see uh, here we see our event base the purchase is pending and it will be tracking it will be active after some time when we do a purchase so we just make a test purchase so finally our purchase event was fired and see the purchase event was fired and here you see one event was fired out brain purchase tag 
and here you can see the variable is passing the id is passing and the uh, value is 7 750 and our water data is 750 so this is how you can track your purchase and it will be activated after some time if you do a refresh so hopefully this video will be very informative for you and you should practice this advertising platform so if you guys need if you are a business owner if you guys need any web analytics server side tracking uh, conversion api pixel and any any kind of digital marketing service i can help you make sure you you visit my website and here you can see here you can arrange a meeting we can talk about more about your business and your goal so this is how you can purchase my service uh, every description in my website so that's all for today's video hopefully i will be coming up with another another more and more informative video so till then take care goodbye and tata